Hello, 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 everybody. Thank you for returning, and welcome to another video. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe for more videos just like this, as well as other various types of videos. All gaming, though. So, for now. But, today, we are playing Cloud Climber. Not to be confused with City Climber. It's totally different. Totally different. I don't know anything about this game. I know that you climb clouds, maybe? Looks like we're just jumping right into it. Another day has arrived. I had oh best my get my water before God. I go to work. My mouse sensitivity is just ridiculous. Oh, poo. I didn't apply. I d oh, apply. Yeah, we'll turn it down a bit more. Apply. That's more like it. Inventory. Oh, click. Hold E to view. Nice. Chest key. Ooh. What is this? Stand diary. Page 1489. I may need to get to the neighboring tower in the future, but I know the other builders keep the entrance to the low bridge locked. I saw a key on the table at the top of our tower a few weeks ago before I went to get more building supplies. I haven't been up there in a few days, so I'll need to check if it unlocks the bridge door. If the other towers become vacant, I might need to get across, so I'll have to keep this in mind. Alright. Chest key. Bucket of water. I have a bucket of water now. Construction on the last tower stopped weeks ago. Okay. I can only assume that the builders have met their fate by now. I believe it's safe enough for me to go and continue building higher yet from where they left off. Oh, so I'm also building? I'll need building? to travel across the other two towers to get there, but I'm sure I can find a way. Oh, man. Oh. Your job seems like it sucks, my guy. Why is there no railing here? Okay, so I have to use water to... You know, provide weight and such at some point. Oh. Bernie the Great and Terrible Diary, page 69. For months we've been building faster than ever, yet it seems as if every time we complete a new level, the clouds raise higher and higher. I could have sworn we were close to them decades ago, but we're still not done yet. I can only hope that we're getting close. Signed, Bernie the Great and Terrible. Alright. This looks nice, though. I like, I like the, uh... The, like, sketched art style. It's pretty cool. Joey Diary, page 420. Light it up! Just kidding. I've been building all day long, and Bernie the Great and Terrible has been sitting on his butt, acting as foreman. In other words, he doesn't do any work and drinks all our water. I've started locking my water chest just in case he really does think he's above us all. Smart. Smart. But what if he becomes dehydrated, man? I can't go in there. Oh. I'm supposed to be going up, right? I hope so. a saw. A bridge door key added to inventory. What do you mean I can't use this ladder? What do you mean? Oh, well, I have to go back down. There's, there's no run button. I can't even cut corners. Hop off the side of the stairs. Oh, come on. Oh, 
Oh, what is this, dude? Oh, is this the key that I just, uh... Yep, sure is. I'm an idiot. Edna Diary, page 36. I can't believe today was the 100th anniversary of our tower. I know the others have been building much longer, and I now wish our grandparents had taken this whole thing, whole thing more seriously. A hundred years ago, they decided things were getting dangerous, but why didn't they see the problem 200 years ago? Or even longer? I'm still glad they started building, but I just wish we had seen this coming. What? Seen what coming? It's been quite some time since I was on the second tower. I haven't crossed this bridge since the builders became greedy and took the supplies that were meant to come to our tower. Just like all the other towers, its inhabitants quickly grew desperate and aggressive. Now it stands empty. Where'd everybody go? Kyle Diary. I guess I knew this day would come, but I didn't expect it to come this soon. Yesterday, we started extreme rationing of our water. A few days back, we stopped getting supplies from the ground crew on our lift. We can only assume that they stolen the supplies for themselves ran out of water and food sources or simply died if we don't get into the clouds soon we might need to see if we can get some from one of the neighboring towers yeah but you stolen it you didn't ask you just stolen it It opens inward. Bertha Diary, page 9,825. Dear Diary, wouldn't it be ironic if it rained now after all these decades of building? Now would, now would that be, now, I'm so sorry. Now would be the perfect time since we've just started rationing our supplies more, but I have a good feeling about things. I know I've never seen the rain myself, but grandmother always told me how wonderful it felt. It would be so surreal to be on the ground and see water for miles instead of desert and wasteland. I'm sure it will rain someday. We just need to survive until then. Okay, so this is uh, like a post-apocalyptic scenario where we're building towers to get to the clouds to harvest water. They installed a rope cart on this level to get to the third tower. I should be able to use it to get across. Probably. <clears throat> Kyle Diary, I tried to be reasonable. I tried to talk to them, but those greedy little scumbags on Tower 1 didn't want to share their supplies with us. I'm not going to die miles above the ground drying up like a raisin while other people watch. I'm going over there tonight to take everything I need so I can last long enough to watch everyone else die. Kyle, you sinister, sinister piece, dude. You're being a real piece. Or you were being a real piece? I haven't seen you yet, so I'm just gonna assume that you died. You turned raisin after all. Oh, come on, dude, let me cut corners. Okay, so... I have to go down here. And move this rope cart to so that's that's my tower and now I'm here and I'm going to tower three Who's doing that? How I could almost call this place beautiful if these dust storms weren't so suffocating. How is this happening? Why am I moving on my own? Please don't get stuck. Also, oh my gosh. How? I hope I find what I'm looking for at the fourth tower. On some real stuff right now, how terrifying would it be in real life for that to just stop halfway through? I mean, what do you do at that point? Just grab onto the rope and 
Shimmy for your life, I guess. Oh, that would suck so hard. Hadang Diary, page one. I couldn't be more frustrated right now. We're running out of water, running out of building supplies, and Carl just won't get along with me. At least five times a day, he pretends he's going to push me off the tower. I swear if I do fall someday, it'll be his fault. Well, push Carl first, man. Joey Diary, 556. Yesterday, Hadang fell off the tower. I don't know how it happened, but it was a shame. Especially since he had the key to most of our water chests. We'll need to break the lock, locked ones open soon since we almost emptied out the other chest. Hadang, no. Did Carl push you? That stupid wiener, Carl. Probably. Is this going to turn into a horror game where I have to run from Carl? Oh, Carl. I just can't get over it. Hedang gives the absolute best reactions when I mess with him. For the past week, I've been pretending to get mad and shove my arms at him as if to push him off the tower. I don't think this will ever get old, and I can tell Hedang loves it. Hedang didn't love it. Maybe you should see if you're... Funny goofs are being received the way you hope they are before you continue, you loser, you idiot jerk loser. Stack of planks. Oh, okay. Looks like I'll need to fix this bridge. Plank. 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 It's hard to believe that I'm the last one here. I never thought it would end like this. Makes you wonder what the whole point was in the first place. A note of ambition. Out of everyone on this earth, our families were the only ones who took the water crisis seriously. We were the ones who started building. We were mocked and told we were insane. We were the ones who everyone looked to when the lakes and rivers dried up. Our blueprints were the ones that were stolen as people became desperate. Uh, out of everyone on this earth, we are the ones who deserve to survive. The clouds are brimming with liquid life, but are still so evasive. We've been building for a long time, but we're not done yet. We have to go farther. We have farther to go. We will climb the clouds. The son of Zilkar. Zilchar. Dewey Diary. Ironic, right? His name is Dewey. Dew is water. You know? This evening, Kevin made a really cheesy speech about how we alone will prevail and how we're the only descendants of the great ones who deserved life. It was honestly the cringiest speech I've ever heard, and that's really saying a lot considering the other stuff he's been saying lately. He also keeps referring to himself in the third person and only responds to us if we call him Son of Zilchar. Uh-oh. Someone's losing it. Can't interact with that door. Neato burrito. Tostito Frito Cheeto. Yeah, I mean, we're close to the clouds, but they are still very far away. Planks? I gotta fix the stairs, probably. Probably. Dude, the art style is cool. I like it. Oh, I have to build more stairs.
Is that it? Oh. This place really wow. is beautiful. Even with the dust storms. It's peaceful in a way. I've been working on that tower my whole life and never once stopped to appreciate what we spent our lives building. We only looked up to the clouds hoping we'd someday reach them so we could prolong our lives. But now that everyone's gone, I know any attempt I might make at accomplishing that would be futile. Rather than spending the rest of my life building a tower, maybe it's time I took a break. It's been a long time, but I think I'm finally done. Bro. Is it about to rain? Sure is. Wow, dude. That was cool. That was really cool. I liked that a lot. It was very simplistic. There wasn't much, like, aside from walking around, there wasn't much gameplay. I mean, I did fix a bridge and build some stairs and stuff, but that's fine. Sometimes there doesn't have to be a lot for it to be something cool. This was really cool. I really like learning why I was up here and what happened and why there were no other people and what was happening to the world to make us develop all these towers. That was, I don't know, it was very relaxing. This game was nice and chill. I, I liked it. I liked it a lot, actually. Um, this was a cool spin on a post-apocalyptic game. Uh, the struggle for water is real. We never did reach the clouds, but it started raining in the end. Sometimes good things take time. Some take a really long time. But... Good things do happen. But that's going to be it for this. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like. It'll help me a lot. And hit the subscribe button. If you subscribe, then leave me a comment saying that you subscribed. And I will respond to you. I guarantee it. And I hope you have a great one. Day, night. Weekend, week, work day, whatever you're doing, I hope it's good, and I will see you around.